Okay, just a quick little update video. This was a clutch that I just hatched out from a Desert Inchy, uh, a tiger by a pinstripe. Okay, and I'm just going to show you a couple of these animals. Uh, I got this is just your, your run of the mill normal. So, just a little normal male. I always like to show my little normal male. So, there he is. So, I got a normal, and I wanted to show you some of these deserts that hatched out because they are absolutely uh, just phenomenal super bright super clean look at that desert next to the normal how nice that is these are pro exotic line of desert here's another and pretty much everything's a male here but here is the uh, I can make him sit still for a second. So that's just a desert. I mean, look how orange those guys are. Orange and clean. They even have that nice banding, too, going on. So I got uh, in a normal, two deserts, a Inchy pinstripe. If I can have her unwind, you can see the orange on the inside there. But an inchy pinstripe female looks like that inchy kind of reduces the striping down and gives a little bit of, uh, uh, I guess, noise in here. So an inchy pinstripe female. Also, a couple of the, of the the nicest tigers that I've ever seen. And I think these are these are these are nicer than Dad was too. I mean these are and these are males as well. But look, I mean look at that guy. And the thing about tigers is they typically get uh, you know better color, better contrast, and just all around get better after they get a few meals in them and just a little bit of size. I mean, these guys are absolutely just smoking right out of the egg. Both of them. Unwind there. I mean, both of them are. If you ever wonder how to tell, uh, you know, if you have a really nice desert, you know, a desert and a tiger, when they're right out of the egg, they, I mean, they look, really look different as they age, but right out of the egg, Sometimes they look similar, but how you tell them apart is that uh, tiger will have a nice, that inchy will give it a nice little skull cap, a reduced head pattern there. You can see that the, it's nice and broad here, but here it's nice and reduced, just like this one here. So these, these are the, you know, the desert inchy combos. And also got a, well this animal was a female here, a, a desert pinstripe. So I can get this in some decent lighting and show it to you. Desert pinstripe, and she's really nice. Desert just makes such a clean, clean, bright animal. It's just yeah. And uh, what I was really hoping for, and I, and I got lucky enough to hit on, was it seems like I never get males when I'm going for the, the you know, the triple gene stuff but the uh, this is an inchy pinstripe desert or a tiger pinstripe I can show him to you pretty good it's a tiger pinstripe and I've seen a couple uh, of pictures of the first couple tiger pins that were produced and he looks and I, I didn't I wasn't too mesmerized by the other ones but this is a really nice animal he's, he's bright orange Reduced. He's got that skull cap. And he's really. It's it's different than I thought. You know, because I heard that people say that uh, just the regular desert pen was really similar to the tiger pen. And it's not true. The tiger pen is it's much more reduced. It's brighter in color, and I mean the head looks totally different. I can show it to you without shadowing it too much. 
Yeah. So that's a male too. So I actually got lucky with the tiger pinstripe male. I don't think there are many of these out there. I mean, I'm sure there are a couple, but there ain't a whole lot of them. <laughs>